This is our new video game setup. On the left we have a Samsung 40 inch HD TV. On the right we have an LG 42 inch HD TV. And if you look over here we have our PlayStation. We have our Wii U. We have all the PlayStation accessories on the top here. There's our headset. You see we have Call of Duty in and under that is Mario. Fixing to show you some cool stuff here. This is our HDMI switcher splitter. And we have our Roku. And we got our Hop Hog HD PBR2 recorder which isn't currently hooked up to a computer but we can still record with it. Down here we have our Blu-ray player. We're going to turn this on just for some fun. And if we go back, you can see that the PlayStation, we're going to sign in here, PlayStation is showing on both screens. Okay, we can go ahead and start our Call of Duty Black Ops. And PlayStation cuts in and out, so that's why you have this searching for signal. You see Call of Duty Black Ops is coming on both screens. That is sound coming from both TVs. And now for the cool part with our uh, splitter here. The TV on the left is TV A, the TV on the left is TV B. So we have our Wii U, which is already on. We're going to change the input on the TV on the left, or excuse me, the right. Helps if you know your left from your right. So go ahead and Go ahead and log in, Shaylee. Log in. So now we have the PlayStation on the left, the Wii U on the right. Okay. And it's warning us about, say okay. That's parental controls. Now the other cool thing is now I can switch number one I'm having an issue because the PlayStation I is in the way we can switch from the PlayStation to also be the Wii U Wii U has uh, HDCP enabled so that's kind of why it takes a minute. So now both of them are on the Wii U. Now I can change TV1, TVA back to the PlayStation. I can also change TVA to our Roku player. Okay, we can also change TVA to the Blu-ray player. Okay, so we can watch a movie and play a video game at the same time. The Wii U has a port on it for headphones, so that works great. We also have the headphones set up for the PlayStation 3, so that'll work. No matter what somebody's doing, somebody can do something else. Um, the other thing that we can do is, you see our Hop Hog HD PVR two flashing down here I can output the PlayStation because I have another device that I'll show you in a second to that in order to record it or I can output the Wii U the Roku or the Blu-ray player we can actually record all three the cool part is this little piece right here 
which goes from the PlayStation via HDMI to DVI and then back out to the splitter. This is what makes us able to record true HD on the Hophog PVR2. So again, as you can see, my little one is playing Mario. And we're going to switch A1 back over to the PlayStation 3. So this is the most ultimate video game setup that I've seen so far. What we want to do is we have a couple of games um, such as Batman Arkham City on both systems. Uh, the Wii U has the hardened edition so we want to see what the differences are and play them side by side. And we should have a video of that up shortly. Place your comments below. Let us know what you think. Have a good one.